Hello fellow Spectec followers, and thanks for joining for my top 5 favorite video games of all time. Today we're going to talk about my number 4 favorite game of all time, which is Power Stone 2. It was released in Japanese arcades in the year 2000, and it was later released on the Sega Dreamcast on August of the year 2000. This game was also later ported along with Power Stone 1 as Power Stone Collection for the PSP in 2006. The game starts out with a cutscene explaining the story. Then there is a floating island and your airplane crashes and you must fight to escape. Fairly simple story. This game is a 3D fighter and it's my favorite fighting game of all time. This game is meant to be played by either 2, 3, or 4 players. You can have either a 1 on 3 battle, a 2 on 2 battle, or a free for all. Now the game can be played by one player, but it's most fun when you get 4 people playing on the same console. It's just absolute chaos when you get so many people playing. The objective of the game is to defeat everyone on screen and leave you being the only one standing, unless you're on a team. There are 14 characters in total, and 16 characters on the PSP Power Stone Collection. In the entire game, there are 10 stages to choose from, 3 of which you have to unlock. Each stage has treasure chests that will have an item in it. The game has over 120 items to use. I say items because some of them are weapons like a bazooka, machine gun, beam sword, but there are also other things like health items and equipment that can help you move faster. As the title suggests, there are things called power stones. There are three power stones that appear in treasure chests, and when you collect all three, your character transforms and becomes very powerful. They have new attacks and two deadly finishing moves. Everyone has two of these finishing moves, although some characters can have up to four. The way you get more items is there's an item shop, and you can either mix, buy, or sell items, or you can even gamble and hope to get rare items. The character Pride will also sometimes surprise you and give you rare weapons, although he also might borrow money from you and never repay you. In multiplayer only, you can use a certain thing called a VMU item book. The VMU is the visual memory unit of the Sega Dreamcast. What you could do is you could download a little icon that would work with your VMU and you would be able to put any five items inside your VMU that you wanted. In the match, a VMU will appear, only you can unlock that and get the, your special item. If you have a Dreamcast, I strongly encourage you to go on eBay and buy this game. I'm really hoping that Capcom will soon release this game on Xbox Live Arcade and PlayStation Network because online play would be a justice to this game. I also hope that Capcom will create a Power Stone 3 since this is my favorite fighting game of all time and there definitely deserves to be a third one. Well that's it for this video Spectec followers, I hope you join me next time for my number 3 video favorite video game of all time.